Hi, welcome back to Swiss Family Fun. I'm Tanya, and today we are in Northwestern Switzerland. We've come up to Weissenstein. We've come on a rainy day. We had the day off, so we had to go somewhere. So come along with us today. Uh, we are going to do, I think about six kilometers. We're supposed to hike out to a couple beautiful viewpoints, hoping that the clouds clear. We'll see. I will put all the details for this on our blog, a link in the description below. And now let's get on the trail. So I'm really happy that my kids agree to come out on a hike like this. Are you in a good? You're in a good mood. Yeah, I am. I'm pretty cold. Are you cold? Yeah. Well, maybe we need one more layer. Uh, but it's nice. I mean, look, a little fresh air, a couple hours out in the rain. It's not so bad. It's not the worst. Time. It's not that bad. Yeah. It's a pretty short hike. Yeah, it's pretty short. We'll see. Actually, the clouds are clearing a little bit. I am hopeful. I think we might see the sun by the end of the hike. That's my prediction. What do you think? Yeah, I think so as well because it's like clearing up. It's supposed to get more dry. Yeah, it'll be better. All right, hopeful. Good. Start with a good attitude. That's not always how we start. Sometimes we start with a bad attitude. <laughs> but I think by the end of the hike, we're always happy. Let's yeah. see what happens today. We might get really wet. Firewood, come next winter. A nice fireplace. There must be a million people that come up here on a sunny day because there are so many fire pits along this place where we can't see the view because it's all in the fog. But it looks pretty nice over here on the sun. We made it up to Roti, one of the viewpoints, which is nice that we don't have fog on this side. This is where we hiked before at the Wolfschluck. That's also on the blog. I'll put a link to it. Very nice. Over there to the huge bear cave. I'll put some pictures in here. And then over to the Wolfschluck. Nice. There's so many hikes here that I need to do. Really don't know this area very well. I was worried when we left the viewpoint up there because it was all fog on this side. But actually the trail has dipped down about 100 meters and now I can see through the trees that we're gonna see the view. So I always wanted to change direction and be like, this isn't gonna work out, we should do something different. Uh, but I think it's gonna work out. Just relax. We're not taking that path going here and it looks like we're gonna go straight up. No switchbacks. Why would you want to switch back? Nice place for a fire. <laughs> the top was so beautiful. I'm so glad that we went up there. I, would, I mean, I was hoping for good weather. I mean, it's not good weather, but I was hoping we could see something. We did, yay! Now we're on our way back down and I wish I had my sticks because it's really wet and slippery. I almost fell just a few seconds ago and yeah, it's really nice. I, I like this hike, even on a day like today. It would be even better on a nice sunny summer day. Look at us dry as a bone. So worried when it was raining hard on the way here that we were gonna be soaked the whole day. Look at us. And then we're gonna have a little lunch here, a little picnic, looks like a nice spot before we descend. I'm always too busy uh, eating to take any footage of <laughs> what food we eat. So I'm gonna give you a little list. Today we have very nice. We have some smoked burrata, we had some salami from Ticino, we had uh, Cambly cookies, dauphin chocolate from Belgium. What else do we have? Oh, we had um, kind of 
premium um, canned tuna, like the, the tuna belly. So good. Uh, delicious crackers and some sourdough bread to eat it with. Uh, oh, um, sun dried tomatoes, some really good ones. They were so sweet. And olives, lots of yummy stuff. So good picnic, but it was freezing. It is really cold. I mean, you stop moving. It's so, so cold. My hands are so cold. Okay, almost done. Yeah, we're getting close. We're getting close. So we joined the road, and now we've got to go uphill. Nice little view out there. All right, we're coming up the final stretch here to Nestle Bolden. It's the middle station of the gondola, and then we'll ride down. And guess what? The sun is out. Look at this. So beautiful. We didn't even get that much rain. I don't even think it really rained on us. Just a couple drops. Gorgeous hike. Really, I don't think there's anything else that we could have done that was better to today. This is great. So I'm gonna give it four to five stars. I mean, it's not the Matterhorn, but it was a really nice hike, especially for springtime. All right, if you like what you saw, I'll put a link in the description uh, to our website where I have all the details for this, how to get here, trail map, all that. And please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And we'll see you here next time for more family fun in Switzerland.